Good morning. Hey y'all, how y'all doing? Welcome back to my channel. Um, you know I'm Coco Colored Ashley, and today I'm just gonna do a day of my life. Um, everything I'm doing today, right now, I'm about to ride to this beauty supply store. It's actually um going out of business. They really don't have that much stuff left because they've been going out of business since October of last year. I caught the end of it, so I did get a little bit of things. Um, but I do want to go see what type of synthetic wigs they have because they don't have any more human hair wigs. Um, so, yeah, that's what I'm about to do now. Um, I never bought a synthetic wig before, so this is going to be something new. And, yeah, I am about to go there. So... That's what we are doing this morning. And how have you been today? It's a Wednesday. So, in the middle of the week. But, for me, Mondays is the day that I really cannot, like, get myself together for some reason. Mondays, I, I do not like Mondays at all. So, Mondays is the day I do not pick to work because I work at home and I get to pick my own schedule. I am a children's counselor, if anybody was wondering. But, um, yeah, so, I'm driving now to the store and I'll see y'all when I get there. Okay. All right. Okay, so we made it safely to our destination. I'm about to get out the car and I'm about to go into this hair store. Now I'm telling y'all, this hair store really don't have nothing in here. Like they they wipe this hair store out um, as they should. You feel me? But I'm hoping that they got something in here that we can, you know, try freak or whatever with the synthetic stuff. Cause now it's popping. I guess you know I don't know. But I'm gonna go try grab some. And up in here, they like, you can only use cash app or cash, okay? So, that's 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 the type of hood I'm in, okay? So, with that being said, I'm going to see y'all in the store. So, oh, I don't even got my mask on. walk back get the mask y'all this is ridiculous but you know that's what the society has came to messed up shorty I'm suited and booted. Suited and booted. I'm hoping they got something here. I done rolled over up here. <sighs> Gotta take a chance. So yes, I'm out for hikes, y'all. So the regular wigs was ten dollars and the lace front wigs was fifteen dollars. So yeah, here is the wigs that I was telling y'all about. They all synthetic. They don't have no more human hair, but I already knew that. I came up here just to see what um synthetic wigs they have and <laughs> also had makeup but they was selling them by the whole case so you could get like uh, all that right there for thirty dollars you could get all that right there for twenty dollars you could get um like they had the prices up there right there like all that for forty dollars um and yeah that's how they wanted you to buy it they didn't want you to buy one at a time they wanted you to buy the whole thing that was thirty dollars um, that was $40. The other one was, I think that's say $15. 
But yeah, that's how the makeup went. I didn't get no makeup. Um, that was $15 right there. That I'm going to So I went finally out the hair store. And so as soon as I got in the car, I got a sale to get to. So I didn't get to show y'all the things that I got. But I definitely will show y'all the wigs that I picked up. But right now, um, this is, oh my goodness, all the stuff that I get from couponing. And um, this girl I know wanted to buy some cleaning supplies. So I had to hurry up and get home. So I can make my sale. So yeah, um, this is all the stuff that I have in my face, neck, um, facial care, shampoo, cleaning supplies, deodorant, razors, um, feminine care. Um, I also have hair care, um, laundry detergent, um, baby stuff like. Baby Soul, Baby Dove, Johnson & Johnson, um, Pampers, Wipes, um, anything you name, I probably have it. Toilet paper, paper towels, stuff like that. My basement is all over the place because I just go keep on it and then put it down the basement. I need to organize it. But, yeah, that's what I had to get to. So, with that being said, this are um, the stuff that um, she bought. I'm literally driving down the street, and this is what I see. It's pretty, though, but, like, um, cars have to come here, sweetheart. So, what are you doing? But, yeah, walking her horse like it's a dog. So, now it's time for me to cook, y'all. So, I get a big old bag of groceries. And, yeah, you're about to get into it. I'm making some homemade mashed potatoes, so... Got some potatoes. I'm making the kids some steak and rice. I don't eat meat, so I'm making me some shrimp, some, some fried cabbage, and peel the potatoes. I'm just seasoning my potatoes with seasoned salt, onion powder, garlic powder, and pepper. I know y'all probably wondering why I'm cutting everything in the sink. I have a cutting board, but this is how I like to do things. I'm weird a little bit. <laughs> So to start the fried cabbage, you will need some olive oil and some onions. And you're going to let that fry up until it gets brown, but not super duper fried onion brown, but a soft consistency. So the seasonings that you will need for the cabbage will be smoked paprika, onion powder, garlic powder, pepper, seasoned salt, regular salt, and that's it. You will need a can of chicken broth and some chicken bouillon cubes to put inside of your cabbage while it's boiling and frying. So the seasons that we're using is similar to what we use for the cabbage. So garlic powder, onion powder, seasoned salt, um, and pepper. That's it. The shrimp is already veined, so what I'm about to do now is to shell it, and then I will be putting um, seasoning on there and letting it marinate. The seasoning that I'm using is Obey Seafood Seasoning, Onion Powder, and Garlic Powder. <music> I'm just about 
to mash the potatoes and um, put some butter and whip it up with a mixer until we get the consistency that you want. I'm adding some um, garlic powder and some onion powder and some pepper and also some roasted potato seasoning. Yeah, that's the key ingredient right there. That'll make it smacking. <laughs> the type of rice I use is this basmati rice. Um, I already put it on, so. So I cut up some onions and some yellow peppers for um, the steak. I'm gonna put the butter in the pan and then put the onions and the um, yellow peppers, orange peppers, whatever color it is, in the pot so that it can um, saute. And then I'm gonna put the steak in the pot once it softens down which i'm doing now and i'm just browning the steak um on both sides and then once it get brown enough you put some water in the pot let it boil and let it cook for a while so the rice is now done and what i'm going to do is put some hot water on top to take some of the starch off and then put it in the strainer so it can drain so now once the steak has um cooked enough you're going to use your onion seasoning pack it's called onion soup that's the key ingredient inside of your steak and now i'm making some gravy so you're going to use flour and water and make sure you use cold water if you're going to make your old gravy because you don't want it to clump up um when you're um mixing it so yeah you're going to get it to a smooth consistency and then you're going to pull it inside of your pan and you're gonna wait until the gravy thickens as it is doing right now. So now the food is ready and I'm preparing two dishes of steak and rice at the moment to feed to the kiddos. So yeah. Now I'm about to cook my shrimp. I'm gonna put butter in a pan and then I'm just gonna put the shrimp in there and let it cook. Um, you really don't have to cook for a long time. You want to at least cook till um, all your pink is gone and it's to the consistency of your liking. I like mine crisp. <laughs> and now here I am praying on my food about to eat. And it is definitely delicious. Trust me. I would not say you the wrong way. <laughs> Make sure you get that H2O in. So we're at the end of the day, you guys. Um, it's been a long day, a long, long, long day. This time I did so when I can get the content in, I do. When I can sit down and record, I do. So I'm thinking about just my everyday life. I'm just going to record it. If it's manageable and I can actually pull my camera out, I will record it. Um, but thank you for watching this video. Thank you for tuning in. Like, subscribe, and comment. If you have not already subscribed, please subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.